It's a new project based on dialogue and I've um, been working with two contemporary artists, two contemporary dancers. And there's some, yeah, there's some pieces which are, um, I, I, I like all the pieces I think. Do I have one which is, yeah, there's some which I really like. My portraits are based on people who have a positive impact on me and who I want to tell a story probably, to create a story from my personal interpretation. But then at the same time, there's still something that I cannot control, which is what's going to come out of what I'm going to paint. Because I just start and then it's probably the colors that are going to lead me from one thing to another. It's probably also the, um, the music that I'm listening to. I work a lot with music. The project started when I was in the art school. I was probably one of the first African students in the school. The aim was not actually to bring out what was African in me, because in any case, that's not the aim of art. It's not just to talk about your origins. It's also just to talk about who, uh, your, your contemporary environment. All cultures have always created prints using elements from their environment. And so from a contemporary point of view, I looked around me and I chose to use the pictogram or you know, the, the signs, the urban signs around me as the starting element to creating the prints that I do. So the prints are actually created from urban elements which you and I use. For example, when you're about to cross the road, you have the green light. So that's a pictogram. I'm going to use that graphically to create a print. So is it African? I don't think so. It's, it's just a form of communication. I'm trying to create a new universal language actually with these prints. I use a technique where I'm painting on perspex using oil paint and it's actually your eye that's going to create the 3D effect. When you're very close to my art pieces, you might actually not be able to recognize, you know, to see the face, the portrait, because you're too close, you're going, just going to see dots, you know, like pixels, if I, if I may use a digital word. But then that also means that you're going to discover the pictogram that I'm using on the background of these art pieces. As you said, you know, it's difficult to, to even film what I'm doing. The best thing is actually to come to the exhibition and see the artwork itself. Art being a form of expression, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to express myself. I'm, I'm trying to talk about humans. Humans are the center of my work, of my interest. I'm trying to find a way in which we can be able to look at each other, probably from a different point of view, trying to see the brighter side of each one of us, the beautiful side of each one of us, the beautiful side of humanity. It's really something that um, I, I wish and I want that art actually also becomes a, um, a means of communication, a means of dialogue, a means to bring people together. We are all born, as Nelson Mandela said, we are, we are all born loving and we learn how to hate. And I think we can still learn again how to love. Just come and enjoy, come and discover. <laughs>